Five Star Property Management, video tour of the property located at 2034 46th Avenue in San Francisco, California. This is a three bedroom, two bath, single family home, a little bit over 1200 square feet. We're gonna give you a very detailed video tour of the property to give you an idea of the layout and flow and ideally save you a lot of time, money, and effort uh, by preventing you having to drive around town to figure out what this property looks like in person. So as we enter here, we have a nice protected little courtyard area. You can put a little table and chairs out here, maybe some plants and really kind of like liven the place up. It's just nice to have this, you know, protected space here. Uh, also packages will be nice and secure there as well. All right, we're, we're going to enter here on the ground floor. We've got a closet. We're going to go ahead and open that up. It's always a, an area that people have questions about is what kind of closet space am I going to have to work with? So we want to make sure we really answer those questions in advance. Open that door up for you here. One of the things I really, really like about this property is the fact that this downstairs area has actually been converted into usable living space. In the past, a lot of these properties, when they were built uh, back in the 40s and 50s, just had really big open uh, garages, which was fine back in the day. But I think for today's modern families um, or, or renters or anybody that may be in this property, it's much more use usable to have this kind of space. As you can see here, you have almost a second living area. Technically, it is a bedroom because you do have a closet, but you could really use this as a great home office, uh, maybe a gym, maybe a nursery, maybe um, some kind of studio. I mean, there's so many different alternative uses with this property, in addition to being a bedroom in terms of this room. Um, I really like the fact that you have these large glass windows as well that face out into the backyard, because the backyard here is actually super, super large. We'll make sure we take a look at that as well. There is an attached bathroom as well, which is a full bathroom um, so it's also a nice feature to have but again just showing you the space here that we have is super super usable and again with people still working from home maybe a few days a week it's just nice to have this large space the dimensions for this room are actually going to be on the website that's going to be go 5 starpmcom again go 5 starpmcom so head over there we're going to get a chance to take a look at the dimensions for this room as well as the high quality photographs and other information about this property and if you do like this unit, uh, there is a link to the online application. You can get that filled out. We'll get this processed. And ideally get this unit locked down for you because I do think this unit will go relatively quickly. Again, this is the full bath that is located downstairs attached to this room. The home has a total of three bedrooms, two full bathrooms. So that means the other two bedrooms and the other full bathroom are going to be located upstairs. Um, as I talked about earlier, we're going to take a little quick detour outside here to take a look at the massive backyard. So it's a little bit overcast right now uh, when we're shooting this video, but we just still want to go out here and show you the, show you the usable space. Um, really, it's kind of up to your imagination with what you can do out here. I mean, table, chairs, umbrella, uh, play area, a recreation area, barbecue area, grill. I mean, really, it's kind of, you know, almost unlimited uses, and it's nice to have this feature and just have a nice private backyard because again if you are working from home a few days a week maybe you want to set up a little outdoor workstation just something to kind of break up you know the routine or even set up a workout station out there who knows but just a lot of options to have at this property here all right uh, we will point out this closet just want to show you this as well because again we know that's kind of a common area and a common question that people have is what kind of closet space do I have? Also point out the vent above the door here because there is central heating at this property. And again, if you're just joining us, this is a property located at 2034 46th Avenue in San Francisco. And showing you one more closet here because again, we do want to make sure we point all of those out for you. There is also a two car attached garage. Um, we're actually going to take a look at that since we're downstairs right now. It's going to be located right here through this door. So again, another super convenient feature to have is just this indoor parking for the cars. It's a tandem garage space. There's a ton of built-in um, storage. As you can see here, we've got the uh, cabinet spaces up here. There's even a sink, which is super cool to have out in the garage in case you're you know, busy working and you get your hands dirty, you can just kind of rinse off out here. Uh, Full-size washer and dryer, workbench over here, and then even more storage space with built-in organizers. And then good lighting in here too. So again, if you are uh, maybe, you know, kind of like uh, handy minded and you've got different projects or crafts you work on. This is an ideal space to have because you can keep the inside of the house nice and clean, but have your workspace out here. So again, super cool property. Uh, the owners have taken really good care of it. And it's nice to see that uh, we've got so much functionality at this property here. So let's continue the tour. We're actually going to head upstairs now. Again, we're back in the main entryway but we still have two full bedrooms and a full bathroom as well as the living room and the kitchen to take a look at at this property. Again, this is 2034 46th Avenue in San Francisco. Let's head up the stairs here and show you the rest of this property. Again, uh, the dimensions for all the rooms that you've seen are gonna be located on the website. That's go5starpm.com, go5starpm.com. 
take a look at that when you get a chance. And we are now here upstairs at the top floor landing. So we've got two bedrooms, one, two up here, full bathroom up here. Um, we're gonna come back to those. We're gonna go take a look at the main living area, the kitchen, dining area, and then we'll kind of make our way back downstairs here. Thermostat right there for the central heating system. And this here upstairs is now again the main living area. So you can see we've got nice refinished hardwood floors in this property. It's nice because you can throw down a rug um, and it's just nice to always have solid surfaces wherever you, know, wherever you are. That's one of the things we really look for in properties is solid surfaces are nice because if you do have allergies or any, any, anything really, just it's much easier to keep things clean and tidy when you've got hard solid surface flooring. So it's a cool feature to point out and you can always throw down rugs to kind of warm things up or kind of change the aesthetic of, of items. All right, giving you one more shot of this main living area. You can see here through that uh, doorway there that there is actually a nice large kitchen and dining area. So, you know, easily set up a nice size dining table right here and you've got access, easy access to the kitchen. The kitchen has been nicely updated as you can see, stainless steel appliances. Uh, everything you see here will be included in the rental of this property. So you've got a nice range, you've got a dishwasher, you've got a super nice fridge and freezer. And you've also got the cool little um, skylight above the sink there. So it's just cool to bring in some natural daylight, which is, uh, again, a nice feature to have some kind of connection to the outdoors when you are indoors a lot of the time. And we'll continue the tour here, just kind of walking through this. You can see there's a lot of cabinet space in the kitchen. So it's another key feature that we wanted to point out. Um, we know that, you know, after COVID, people really are from what we've seen anyway, they really are cooking at home a lot more, experimenting in the kitchen. So having this availability of cabinet space is always something that people um, are super interested in. We're gonna now make our way to the second of the two bathrooms. It's gonna be located up here to our right. So this will service the two bedrooms up here. Uh, when, the, when these homes were designed, they didn't really have the, you know, the same concept of like a master bedroom or master suite with an attached bath. So this is a much more functional design, really. So you've got the bathroom right here, which will service again the upstairs area. And then you had the bathroom downstairs, which would service the downstairs area. And again, it's nice because if it's a roommate scenario, you don't have somebody having to walk through a bedroom to access the bathroom. It's just right there. Um, we're going to take a look now at the first bedroom that is located up here. Because again, we have a total of three bedrooms and two full bathrooms here at this property. This bedroom is going to look out over the backyard as well as the bedroom that's to the left of us, which we'll take a look at in a minute. So they're all going to be facing out towards the backyard and just showing you a nice angled shot of this room. Dimensions again are going to be on the website. That's go5starpm.com, go5starpm.com. So definitely go take a look at that. And we'll show you one more shot of this room from another angle here. And we will open up the closet door as well, just to make sure we show you what is available space-wise in that area. And we know that these tours can be a little bit lengthy, but again, we really want to, in a perfect world, save you a lot of time, money, and effort, because we know gas prices are kind of insane right now. And even if you have an electric car, you know, charging costs are definitely going up. So by doing this, we're really kind of doing our part to help the environment, help save you time, money, and uh, effort as well, because really, with this tour, I mean, you should get a really good sense of whether or not this layout and flow could work for you. And if it does, then that's great. You can submit an online application. You can even schedule a tour to come look at the property in person. But if not, it also just you know checks this off your list and allows you to move on. Uh, you don't have that uncertainty of thinking, oh, is this a good property? Yes, no. Uh, pointing out a little linen closet right there. So really just to you know help alleviate the uncertainty is what the bottom line is with these video tours. Uh, we really want to be detailed and the feedback has, has always been positive on them. So we definitely want to continue to do these and really just you know let you shop from the comfort of your current home while you are looking for your new one. So this is gonna be the third and final bedroom now. This is the second bedroom upstairs, but it is the third and final bedroom. A uh, good size room as you can see, nice view out into the backyard. And we'll just give you a nice little overview here of all the angles of this room. And we will take a look at the closet space as well. And if this is a property that may not work for you, then definitely take a look at our website, go5starpm.com, because we do have other properties listed there all, all over the Bay Area, uh, pretty much focused on San Francisco, down the peninsula, down to San Jose. Uh, occasional properties in the East Bay, but really the, the bottom line is San Francisco and down the peninsula. But take a look, there should be something else, and if not, there will be something else that pops up soon. So you know, just keep checking back on a regular basis, and we will have all of our most recent properties listed there. So we are getting close to wrapping up the tour. Again, that was the last bedroom, the 
third and final bedroom. We are upstairs here, and we're gonna head back down and head out the front door. Just a reminder, that's the kitchen over there to our left, the main living area. We've got an additional skylight right there above us, which is nice to really bring in a lot of natural light to this hallway, or to the, to the stairwell right here. And we're gonna make our way back down to the main entrance, and that's really gonna wrap up our tour. So again, if there are any questions that we missed, uh, please feel free to reach out. But uh, if not, then we look forward to maybe meeting you in person one of these days for one of the tours or helping you to move into one of these great properties. So thanks so much for taking a look, taking the time to watch, take care.